If it had not been for Bill Sr. and the support of the Gates Foundation, our work would not have been nearly as productive as it's been able to be. Many of us in the international development world, without Bill, we wouldn't be here. What he did as a champion for land rights and as a champion for Landessa is he completely put Landessa on a, on a different trajectory. Bill came over to our office. We thought it was going to be a, a kind of informal, brief meet and greet. We found ourselves very much on the same wavelength. He seemed to resonate with the idea that we were trying to use law and policy to make economic and social change. He quickly grasped the importance of providing not just land rights for a household, but who within the household really has those rights. Really understands the value of women, that they hold up half the world, and that if you fund women, you fund their education, they will in turn make sure their children are educated. And at a very fundamental level, he really understands that. Bill Sr. Is, is such a hero of mine. He's someone who has made such an impact in his life and done it with such sincerity and authenticity. I feel honored by the fact that we're able to acknowledge the wonderful work that Bill Sr. and the Foundation have done. I can't think of anybody better to get it than Bill. I mean, he's the giant sequoia in the forest when it comes to uh, being an icon for global development and poverty reduction. You know, there's a, a Jewish prophet, Micah, who gives kind of simple but I think very valuable guidance for how to live a good life. And that, that advice, if I could paraphrase it, is practice kindness, seek justice, and walk humbly. And to me, that is what Bill Sr. is about.